Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Ultimate General Civil War. We're going to be your host, Lucky Marine, and nearly forgot what we were playing then until, well, until I looked at what we were doing. Second bull run. We beat the uh, the enemy at Shiloh and Kettle Run, I think it is. Nope. So Shiloh doesn't count towards this one. It's just the, the two smaller battles that we had just before this. Uh, the Kettle Run, so 2.5% army size and... Alright. So a, a combined 5% less people to uh, up against. Recent events of the the campaign, Confederate forces under Stonewall Jackson. Yep, I think we've already read that, haven't we? Let's go. The whole line thundered with the incessant volleys of musketry. Actually read it. Good. Main army is going to be... You. I think we, we need to get more people. I think we just need to start fielding more brigades. On the recent events of the Pinnitsa campaign, yep, I think we've read that. As the communication with Washington were threatened, and we had to abandon our defensive lines along the Rappahannock River. Jackson withdrew a few miles to the northwest, and we follow his path with a good chance to trap him. And main arm is going to be here. Okay, we'll do that. We're not going to have a rear guard. We'll see how we go. Peninsula campaign has failed and McClellan has withdrawn to Washington. Meanwhile, the rebels are raiding our supply lines. We must head north and consolidate our forces. So look at the terrain. Here we will rally our army and then we'll march north. What in the middle of the open? That's going to be a good plan, isn't it? <clears throat> Confederates are present in the area and are moving northwest. Probably their cavalry coming back from a supply raid in Manassas Junction. Watch them, but keep moving. Okay. Some of our units are moving through the town of Groverton towards our rally point. That seems a decent rail point. Rebels are attacking through the woods. It seems we're facing mounted skirmishes. We can advance to this hill and capture their artillery. Okay. Oh, stop. Now, Daniel. You're one of the new guys, aren't you? Yeah, low efficiency. I think he's just a, uh, a major or something. Sorry man, but the, uh, the new guy gets to be the diversion. Hazelman has come in uh, in place of Toon, who's currently getting fixed. Let's try to rush you into those woods. Let's try and rush all these guys into the woods. I will sweep up through the woods. Brewster, you into the middle. And the horses, the cannons, even. Let's just bless you on that hill. Mounted skirmishers and cannons. Right. Talking of skirmishes. Let's see what we're up against. Now, hopefully.
the cannons or waste the shots on, well, skirmishers. Yeah, I need you to run now. Let's get you firing into... Into the town. the side. Are right, you involved? How are you in the town itself? Let's try and take out these cannons if we can. Make sure they route a little bit further away. Take out the commander. No, would it be not? They're in some good cover here, unfortunately. Need you focus on Trimble, it looks like he's about to charge. Nope, yes, nope, yes. I'll try to cut him down before he gets to your ranks. And let's focus fire on Talifero, who's doing weird maneuvers. I don't like this. I don't like how they can. route through your forces. Yeah, we need to continue trying to get these to route. You're running away from skirmishers. Uh, we're in melee here. That's not good. Alright, so you've rallied. Let's get into the town. Let's help out our guys over here. And Atkinson, I need you to turn around and come back. So these guys have left the battlefield entirely. Can you get any flanking shots? Might be able to. Might be able to get them to route right now. You switch fire onto the skirmishers, get them away. And let's capture Louisiana Brigade before these skirmishers take them back. Uh, 
and push up a little bit more. Daniel, I need you back there. Whew. Proceeding to the next day. That was a quick day. Um, got a little bit messy, but we got there in the end. Stonewall Jackson is defending and makes us to believe that he is trapped. As long as no rebel reinforcements are present, that is merely true. We must prepare for a major assault. But in order to keep the initiative, we could attack in waves until our whole army is fully operational. We're not going to be attacking in waves. I know that right now. Especially into uh, mega uber defensive positions. Okay. Yeah, I think they can use this train track as well uh, as, a, as a defensive line. Left flank, eh? Yeah, I was thinking attacking up through this way. Although there is a lot of up and ground. Oh, I don't know. Depends if we can get over the river here. And then get in behind them. Not fun to split my forces up. Right, Daniel. Daniel and Daniel. These that sound like my people. No, we'll we'll all head north. We haven't got a point that we need to, to defend, we only have to take those, therefore we don't have to uh, worry about defensive positioning. We can just go mega uber aggressive. Right, Daniel and Daniel. That's not going to be annoying at all. Let's get the skirmishes. to cover. Let's see what we're dealing with. Okay. So this isn't a crossing. We might end up taking some losses. Uh, probably just from cannon fight. It depends if they've pushed up to this line. If they're still on the on this line here, we might be able to get all the way around the back. Maybe. But if we can't cross the river here, what makes me think that we're going to be able to cross the river up here? I wish you could do secondary actions. Like, have this route here, but then press control or shift or whatever and do another one. So you can, right, once we, once we get to there, can we then get across this river from there to there? I don't know if we will be able to. Hmm. There's no way. There's no way I'm stepping before into this. This is just going to be a dead zone. Right, Daniel. Let's get you over there. Let's bring two of you this way. I'd like to you to go undetected. If all possible. You're exhausted already. 
I suppose these guys have just come from uh, the last fight that we were in. so quickly that they're taking a defensive position on the uh, on the railroad and so you just sit there you should be out of sight turn off firing yeah they're in this is a uh, a defensive position this is uh, another defensive position as well as is this portion down here yep Greg's on on that if we can get in and around the back of them oh you've been seen pull back just a bit looks like branch is heading up to this one here. We might be able to have turned the flank already. Yeah, I'm going to need you two to run now. We need to get you into position, we also need you into support. Let's bring our cannons to there. Hmm, General Lee, hey? So you're not quite in the houses just yet. Still not in the houses. This is a bit fiddly. Trying to get your people into a fortified position. you all the way across the river. Let's have you firing them. You should be out in the open. Pull you around the side. Wearing semi cover. And they're not. Or they shouldn't be. Get shots on. This, this action will drag some units across this way. Oh, excellent. Am 
managed to get them to route. Now let's move forward a little bit just to deny them the cover of getting into these uh, these buildings. the river and we'll take out the skirmishers sweep out the uh, the cav Should be able to deal with skirmishes. Alright. Stonewall is about to break, I think. Alright, we force them off their defensive position. Push a little bit further in with Daniel and try turn for now. all that shouting it's usually because uh, someone's charging at you and you want to focus down whoever's getting uh, too close all right focus fire hmm seems he's wounded this guy here doing good job doing good work though and he's in decent cover false skirmishes out into the open that should be easy fight we have our cannons up Move you into a fortified area. Try to get flanking shots if you can. If we turn ever so slightly, we might not get flanked by this. Uh, that shouting coming from by the cannons here. Can you not fire them? You fire, you fire, and you fire as well. Hmm, looks like fields coming back onto position. So I managed to route them. I need you to turn back around and face the cav. I need you backfiring a branch along with you. Here. 
So the field is out in the open field. Duke and I with skirmishers that seem to be getting the upper hand there. This is a little concerning. Let's try turn early away. I've routed those. Anyone yeah, now in the open? Not really. Let's have you firing and bring you up fairly close. I think this is where the end of Greg finishes. We can be in the woods. How are we getting on? Good. Continue moving. do these cannons stopping firing however we can't get too close to archer let's push across this river I'm worried with this flank um, if we can clear out the enemies here then we can concentrate on these defenses or maybe even sweeping around the back But for now, Daniel, I just need you to hold the ground there. Protect the cannon. Take out them. Let's get you sweeping around here. Try route these skirmishes if we can. And you firing at them as well. Skirmishes are gone. We should no longer be flanked. Oh, we are. Alright, so branch has been routed. Switch fire onto early. Let's get him routing as well. And Whitaker should be able to finish what Summers started. Thankfully, he's running in a decent direction, or he's routing in a decent direction. He's not routing back across the river. Shots on Stuart. Nope. No, not that way. Ah, 
How... How did this happen? How did you allow these to get past you? Nope. You that way. You back this way. You're not even covered there. Let's move you back a little bit. Now you can fire, and you can fire, and you can fire as well. Okay, we've taken out. Can we get across there now? So kind of, we're stuck. We do have access to their cannons though. There's not many of them. No, you can fire across that river. I know you can. Yeah, I need you to stop round right now. back into the tent. Whitaker's decided to uh, have a little bit of run around. Cavalry are big targets, so if you can get a, uh, a good volley on them, a lot of them go down. So just the 620 of Trimble on this edge. Let's get you back into Fortified buildings, apparently. You, the same. Now let's have a concentrated attack. On this. Just go for it. Might be able to. Uh oh, might run out. 
of time. Attack Jackson again. Okay. Oh, reinforcements. Excellent. And somebody in from here. Yeah, I, I think we might. So we're out of the cannons away. And you need ammunition. Bring the ammunition truck up. Greg's starting to move away from his position. Try continue to get shots on Trimble as he's running. Daniel, you follow behind, and let's move up. Yeah, let's move up through the uh, woods. How we get on here? Not doing too bad. I mean, our center's wide open. in the woods we'll have defensive bonus as well there's only 210 here okay even less a couple more volleys and they'll just route straight off the field I get a two to one going on here. You try to route these skirmishes. Good stuff. I'll move in to surround them. Daniel, you can protect the flank from, I think, skirmishes and cavalry are up here somewhere. This flank has stalled. To an extent, I think they've dragged a lot of the troops this way. I recognize the uh, Greg. So we managed to route them. Let's get into full cover. I'll try to get rid of the cannons. Nope. Oh, you. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like 
somehow sometimes they'll just fire at them until they get out of range and then that'll be it and other times they'll actually go and follow them there needs to be a, a toggly switch so that you can switch between yeah go follow them and no don't Are we getting reinforcements? I seem to remember that was a thing. Alright. Let's start pressing this. I think they've started to commit a lot of men over here now. Just a little bit. Why do you, why do you, why does the whole thing have to turn around? Why can't you just? No, face that way. Atkinson, still can't click you. Alright, let's get through the position if we can. Be right on the edge there. And let's press in with Atkinson as well. Then I get our spy truck up there. Well, you're a little bit too late. I thought they were never coming. That was why, well, I'm, I'm gonna have to push this ourselves. Oh well. Battle's all over. Let's get you lot. Just there. take out these cannons as well before they do any more damage. You're done. And well, let's push. Through the position. And let's start putting the squeeze on them. So you're writing. Let's get into some sort of cover. Thomas looks like he's charging. Let's try and stop that. You look like you're charging as well. Let's try and stop that. As with you. Let's 
Let's push you into the uh, the cornfield. Just charging into position. Right, who are you firing at? Yep, got two and one on Thomas. We should turn him fairly quickly, um, and we're starting to press in either side of the pincer. By the time our people get to the front, um, this dead zone won't be a dead zone anymore. This kill zone won't be a kill zone. There won't be enough men on the defences facing in the right direction <clears throat> to uh, for this to be a dangerous position to be in alright skirmishes have been routed position and let's run you straight into those woods This, is, this hasn't flipped back. I suppose we are the closest to it. Nope. I need you in the woods. Not woods adjacent. In the woods. Gary should be able to call Johnson. you even further forward. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Victory, that was a weird one. Um, I don't think that didn't think that didn't went I didn't think that went too well. Um, a little bit of a diversionary attack over here faltered a little bit ultimately ended up stalling but tied up enough people that left this area undefended um, there was a couple of skirmishes there was a section of horse but not enough to stop I think there's uh, five divisions that we we pushed in here and then it was just a case of squeezing them by the time our reinforcements arrived, which I think they were late, I, I think they were late. Um, the wall was the wall. The, uh, the the battle was pretty much already going in our favour. All right, let's see what we got. Full victory. Yeah, they all did well. Atkinson took quite a few losses for what he dished out.
Oh yeah, we got prisoners, didn't we? Did anyone have a, a nightmare? Not really. Nah, they all did alright. Apple was... Yeah, that's probably the worst performance. Oh well. Officers, we've got... Summers, yep, he was wounded up on this flank. I think uh, it was actually flanking shots that wounded him. <clears throat> A lot of our majors have upgraded our le le lieutenant colonels, as we say in Britain. Or lieutenant colonels, as I say in the USA. Get upgraded to colonels, which is good. And we captured some Napoleons. Wow, we captured a lot of stuff actually. Okay. And we got a, the Union Protector Star. I'd still like uh, to be able to hover over this and tell us tell, tell us what it was for. I don't know. Exchange prisoners for some additional recruits. Superb. Let's spend our two career points on. What do we get? Ammunition, maybe. Or politics. Mm. Training. That's ten percent cost of veteran units. They they are expensive. Yeah, we'll do that. So our A team didn't really get touched. We fought almost an entire fight with uh, with the B team. Uh, granted, I had swapped out some people around because I, we didn't have enough money or enough people to fully out fully flesh out these troops. So I put all the uh, all the fully fleshed out troops in our first call. Our B team didn't do too bad. Daniel, let's grab the endurance course. Let's fill you with rookies. Sir, okay. yes, sir. Indeed. Atkinson. Again, endurance course. Now let's fill you with rookies if we can. Let's swap you out for. Hmm. I want Toon to come back and be A team material. Andrews, let's swap. Swap you out for Toon. Loomis, Walton, Toon. A team. means we can put Andrews in charge of you. Johnson in charge of you. Grab the endurance course for you guys. Who else do we have? We have colonels and majors in reserve. You can have a colonel, you can have a major. Can I have a lieutenant colonel? It just raises the efficiency up just a little bit. Walton, you can have endurance course. And we'll try fill you with, with rookies. Yes, sir. Enough to retain the uh, the extra marksman marksman training and the rest with veterans in a bit. You can have rookies. Yes sir. You can have rookies as well. 
Asking you. Did we lose any cannons? We did not. Yes, sir. Now, do we dump a load of cannons into our artillery units? There is a point, I think it's about reading the forums, uh, about 14 or 15, where the efficiency of cannons starts to drop. You actually get worse. Um, worse uh, performance out of them. The more cannons, that we, which makes absolutely no sense. Anyway. So A team is fully fleshed out. B team, let's get you sorted. Yes, sir. Yep, your side as well. Uh, two, three, four. Let's get two more. Got cannons there. Let's get a uh, yeah, artillery brigade here. Let's get the 24 pound howitzer. And let's have 12 of them. And Gary can have them. Gary with his 24 pound death machines. Uh, and you need infantry brigade. What equipment are we going to give them? We'll give them Harper's Ferry. Yeah, we've got enough of them in the shop. So two fairly even cores. Hmm. What do we get in the armory? Don't use that. Let's get rid of those. Cav, we don't use the sword or shotguns. Artillery, we don't use six pounders. Infantry, anything below about. Well, just everything actually. We don't use any of them. Right, can we swap out any of these for more Harpers? You're still Springfield. So the second core is a, a mishmash of Springfield and Harpers. The, the first core is mostly Harpers and Ferry. Harpers Ferry even. Um, with just Johnson. With the, uh, the Springfield. Hopefully we don't take too many losses in the next fight and we can we can uniform our entire uh, both our calls with the Harpers. Having everybody that can fire at exactly the same range. Um, all that can engage with the enemy uh, uh, a set range will make our volleys more effective. Especially if we're doing two on ones. It looks like we're going to have to spend some reputation because we we had a hundred reputation before that last fight, and we still got hundred reputation. So don't need that. We need money, really, don't we? We'll take the money. Brings our morale boost from fifteen down to nine. But that's fine. We can now outfit you with decent weapons. Line. 
Walton, let's get you Harper's as well. Oh, there's just not enough in the shop. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. A little bit into supply. 20,000, 30,000. Yeah, 25,000 each. Let's see what we're up against. In obedience to my received orders, we battled the enemy at the second bull run and lost almost all of our artillery and supplies. I've already sent my battle report to headquarters, but please make sure your general will receive my request for more troops. If I don't want to support quickly, I will have no chance to hold against Ligarine. General, this message is strictly confidential and must not be discussed yet with your subordinates. We have strong indications that rebels are mustering more than 60,900 troops to reinforce their corps after the battle of the second bull run. In order to preserve the morale of your army, please handle this information with discretion. In other words, don't tell them. I get you. So what have we unlocked? Crampton's Gap South Mountain, which leads up to... Why can't I click on the, the main one? Hmm. You could always click on the main one before. Now it looks like at this stage you have to do one or the other of, uh, of these before you can unlock. I don't know what it would be. You can't even click it, can't even hover over it, can't even... I uh, can't even see. Can we zoom in the map? I like that. What happens? 14th. So they both happen on exactly the same day. So which one do we take first? Crompton's Gap or South Mountain? I don't know, but it will be in the next episode, ladies and gentlemen. I've been like Rain, as always, you lot have been amazing. Uh, this is Ultimate General Civil War, and I've been. Having, I'm having a quite a, a good time. It's uh, It's quite enjoyable. They are still working on it. Um, it is continuing to to be improved. Um, there are a few interface issues that we've run into, which I would like sorting out. Maybe. I mean, yeah, it'd be nice. It'd be nice. I'd also like this number when it reaches a hundred. I'd like it to turn red so that it actually. He informs you that actually you, you've got to the maximum reputation that you can get to. Um, it would be efficient right now to spend at least a little bit of it. Anyway, until next time, do take care.